I thought I was going to die. An unbearable couple of seconds that felt like an eternity. I started yelling for my kids, shut your doors, shut your doors, there's a bear in the house. Moments later, this small five pound pooch appeared. And my dog came out, started barking and got the bear's attention and got the bear outside and uh, he saved my life. But Sweet Pickles lost his while protecting his family. There was nothing I could do. Like I wanted to go out there and jump on the back of the bear and save my dog. Me too. Bring me here. Tonight, as Tiffany and her daughter here. Emily grieve, they also yeah, reflect on all the good times. Oh, what a sweet doggy! They once shared with their beloved pets. You are so precious. He was always with me. If I stayed up late, he stayed up late. If I wanted to go somewhere, he wanted to go somewhere. The most thing I liked about Pickles was how he would put us to bed and bark if someone was here and how he would just lay next to us. And although Pickles won't be there anymore to lie next to them, the Merrills hope their story makes their neighbors more cautious the next time they see a bear. Oh my goodness. They're way more dangerous than what you think they are. After what happened to me this morning, like. Uh, who would have ever thought that would happen? I've, not me. In Black Mountain, Stephanie Sanastasi, News 13.